Hi TIs, hi good people. Good morning, it's Sherry and I am here with some free and valuable information for information that helps you to benefit yourself as well as others. So, um, like the name of my channel says, Sherry's Research and Reviews, I want you to benefit from my research and reviews. And today I will be reviewing a um, product called Hello Brand Toothpaste charcoal based whitening toothpaste okay it claims to whiten and brighten but is it safe and does it work does it do what it says it's gonna do it does and it's under ten dollars at your local walmart okay so if you don't want to watch the video you just get that part right away okay it works um so for those of you who don't know me hi ti is hi good people hi um i'm sherry and the name of my channel is research and reviews and i do research and reviews on things like um well, I do research on things like advanced satellite-based technology, psychology, uh, a little bit deeper things. Um, but I also do, and I also do, reviews on regular everyday consumer products. Um, things like mostly uh, beauty, health and beauty, you know, hygiene, hair things, makeup, skin tips, um, you know, toothpaste, uh, pet products. So that those kind of things. Because I think it's important when you review something, when you buy a product, to let people know, you know, if it's helpful. Again, that's the goal of my channel, is so that you can benefit yourself um, and others from the research and reviews that I do, okay? So, um, yeah, so today, again, Hello Brand toothpaste, that charcoal-based whitening toothpaste at Walmart for under $10. You can probably buy it anywhere, but this particular tube I bought at the local Walmart. Okay, wasn't even looking for it. I had kind of seen commercials for it, and then it kind of, you know, I was in the aisle, and I kind of like to make meander <laughs> when I'm in the store, because I like to see products, you know. If you have an issue, and there's a product that can fix it, well, you know, sometimes you, and you never know. There's little hidden gems in the store, so I really do like to scan the aisles. You know, it's a relaxing experience. <laughs> I feel like I'm in the marketplace, okay, um, even with my targeting. <laughs> but uh, anyways, I also used to want to be a dental hygienist. I don't know if you guys know that, but this you know, this, you know, I think this is like me fulfilling that desire. Okay. So, um, <laughs> yeah, I like teeth. Teeth are important, right? We all need them. We need them to smile. You need them to eat, you know, you need them to function. Okay. So, um, yeah. So why not keep them? Why not whiten and brighten them? Okay. So, uh, I used to drink a lot of coffee. I recently stopped my coffee intake. I'm trying to switch over to tea bags, which is good. Walmart has a really good, um, teas. They, they come in a little really beautiful little uh, uh, container. You know, there's different kinds. I got like useful beachy and it's like orange and pink on the box and, and the inside. There's like 10 bags and they got little, they got, there's tea in there, but they also got like little chunks of raspberries, you know, and it's tasteful because a lot of times tea just tastes like tea, you know, but this one actually does have a little raspberry taste to it. So I'm trying to get used to that. I'm not a natural tea person. I do love coffee. I still drink it. I just don't buy it at home. So I'll go out and have a cup of coffee or whatever. I digress. So all those things, you know, um, I used to be a smoker. I stopped years ago and that helped definitely but you know to each his own and it takes time and if you're ready or whatnot but anyways um so everyday things can wear and tear on your teeth even things like fruit you know if you eat blueberries or if you eat cherries or whatever you know all those things the acid and all that um can can wear on your teeth so um i have tried whitening strips and they work i do not doubt their effectiveness however i don't like the after effect that it makes your teeth real sensitive that i don't like okay so um so this toothpaste seemed like a, I, I was willing to try it out, okay? Um, also, too, I drink with straws. I try to drink every um, drink with straws. A dentist told me that. That way you're not letting the actual liquid touch your teeth, you know, the coffee or the tea or the juice or the soda, whatever, you know, try to drink with a straw. But then also, too, when you drink with a straw, you kind of mess with these muscles right here. So as you get older, you're wearing and tearing those muscles more. So you you can't win, I tell you. <laughs> but try, maybe just try not to drink that much. <laughs> That's a good thing. I'm always, you know, drinking some type of liquid. I'm hydrating myself always. Anyways, I digress. Okay, you guys want to hear about the product, yes? Okay, here you go. I'll give you a little show and tell here too. All right, so this again is charcoal-based whitening toothpaste, okay? It's charcoal-based um, and charcoal, you know, dried wood charcoal. And the thing about charcoal is it's a binding um agent so that's why they use it like to uh, pump stomachs for you know overdoses or whatnot because the the um charcoal binds with the um chemicals or drugs in your body and will um you know so that all the toxins so that you can just you know secrete it okay also too though it's non-discriminatory which means uh charcoal will also bind with other things like you need like nutrients you know and get rid of that too so you know use sparingly that's why it's only used for usually medical treatments type of stuff okay so 
Um, so keep that in mind. You have to be careful whenever you're trying products. So this one I tried on myself. Remember, I'm not a professional. I'm just giving my personal opinion. Okay, just so we know. <laughs> Little disclaimer there. All right, so um, one of the things that's nice about this is it's got organic, certified organic. That's what this says. You know, there's a list of ingredients on the back, um, one of them being coconut oil, which is nice. Um, you know, to me, when I use it, it, it tastes fresh. Like you wonder, you know, if it, it's it's charcoal, it's not gonna, it's gonna leave a funny taste. But they must use the same ingredients that they use in other toothpaste, um, as far as breath freshening, and it feels minty afterwards. Fresh and minty. Um, it's a little gritty, so you have to rinse well. Plus, your mouth gets black, so you have to really, really rinse well, like three times, three to four times versus your usual two. So double, double the rinse. You'll you'll be able to tell because there'll be a black residue on your teeth. Okay. Also, too, um, important side note: this has no fluoride in it. Okay. So now, fluoride is one of the main ingredients in in water and in toothpaste. All right. Um, when I research other videos, including consumers like myself, like you guys, and also dentists, um, professionals, they were mentioning that that was a drawback of this, that it did not have fluoride. But then again, I heard fluoride might be kind of damaging. Who knows? And dentists maybe have to say that because that's their, I don't know. But um, one other thing that they mentioned, I'm on the fence about that part, you know. Um, but anyways, one thing they also did mention too was that it can stain over time because it's a binding agent. Um, it does. It doesn't whiten. It lifts stains, which does. I thought that's what whitening is, but no, it it lifts the stains. Okay, good potato potato. I guess you know whatever as long as it gets whiter and um, brighter. And but they say that over time this can cause staining, staining particularly in the gum line, and then that can lead to gum disease. Yeah. So I don't know. Um, the product, to me, you know, it says that it's gentle, certified organic, you know, um, but who knows, you know, that just tells me I have to do more research. So, um, it's a great as a booster, I feel like, but because of the risk and because there's not a lot of data on this, the dentists were saying, I'm still going to research it myself because, again, you never know, right? Um, it does, I do know that it does give immediate results and, uh you know, it works for what it says it's going to. But with me, I'm going to use it. I'm still going to definitely use it, um, but it's not going to be my everyday toothpaste. Like, I was going to replace my everyday toothpaste, but no, that's too big of a jump. I think because of the risks, I'm going to use this as, like, a booster. So I'll do it, like, you know, maybe once or twice a week, you know, and get the whitening effect, or maybe do it, like, for a week straight, five days straight, and then lay off of it for, like, a month. You know what I mean? To get the effect and then without the without the bad side effects. And of course, research more, okay? So so that's it, yeah, this wonderful little project. Product, Hello Brand Toothpaste, okay? Charcoal-based whitening toothpaste. It works, it's under $10 at your local Walmart. I, I would suggest it as a consumer. Again, I'm not a professional, but, um, but yeah. So I would show you what it looks like on camera if you really wanna see all that, but I, I've already done it. Actually, I did a video before this and it, it didn't turn out right. Um, Somebody told me to look at the lens when I'm filming instead of the screen and it shows up better, but I, I can't get it quite right. I don't know. Bear with me here. So, but I already brushed them and they did, they do turn a shade whiter. I wish I could show you the before and after. Maybe I'll do that on one video in the future, but for now, you know, it's under $10, so it's, it's worth it. And it does, it does what it says it's going to do. It is a good product. Okay. Um, I wouldn't use it every day though. That's it. That's my final conclusion. So again, I hope you good people, UTIs and everybody, uh, want you to benefit from my research and reviews. All right? Make sure to do your own research, okay? And remember that the true God loves us. All right? Uh, thank you so much. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you like these videos so you can get more of them in the future. Hit the little notification bell too because then you get notified when a new video comes out if you're interested, okay? If you learned something, which I hope you did, okay? I hope you benefited. Do your research. The true God loves us. Thank you. Goodbye.